Hello, this is Sophie from Native Instruments. In this video, I'm going to show you how to route sounds from Machina 2 loaded as a plugin to single tracks in Pro Tools. This setup allows you to tweak Pro Tools track parameters such as volume and panorama for individual sounds rather than an entire group or master. First, create some tracks in your Pro Tools session by clicking the menu entry Track New. Create one stereo instrument track. Click the plus icon and create 15 stereo aux input tracks. Choose create. Pro Tools will then create the tracks you just defined. Next, select Window, Mix to go to Pro Tools Mixer View. Load an instance of Machina 2 onto the instrument track by clicking an empty insert slot and choosing multi channel plugin, instrument, Machina 2 AAX stereo. Now load a drum kit in Group A. Press play to hear what we just loaded. By default, all the sounds are routed to the Machina master output via their group. Now you're ready to assign the sounds in Machina to their own individual output channels. Select the first sound you want to route. In this case, it's our kick drum. Click the channel icon button and open the output menu. Select the audio tab and choose external one. Apply the above steps to all other Machina sounds you want to route to separate channels in Pro Tools, selecting a different output for each sound. So for our second sound, labeled strike, select external two. For the third sound, labeled SFX, external three, and so on. Now we've routed all the Machina sounds to their own individual output channels. Close your Machina instance to see your Pro Tools mix of you. Next, you have to set up the input for each of the auxiliary tracks. By default, the sound assigned to external one, in this case our kick, will be coming out of the instrument track hosting your Machina 2 instance. Therefore, we will start with the first auxiliary track, AUX1. On the channel strip under I.O., select Plugin, Machina 2, External 2. In the second auxiliary track, AUX2, select Plugin, Machina 2, External 3. Repeat these steps for the rest of your auxiliary tracks to have all of your Machina 2 sounds routed correctly. Now we have routed the individual outputs of our Machina 2 sounds to separate auxiliary tracks in Pro Tools. So the Machina sound assigned to external 2, our strike, will send its audio to our first auxiliary track, AUX1. The sound assigned to external 3, our SFX hit, will send its audio to our second auxiliary track, AUX2, and so on. Now press play. In your Pro Tools project, you'll see all of your Machina sounds coming out of separate Pro Tools tracks. If you solo one of them, you will only hear the sound assigned to it. Please note that all of your Machina group or master effects are now bypassed. This means your Machina sounds may sound different when the signals are routed directly to auxiliary tracks in Pro Tools. For more information on Machine's routing hierarchy, 
please check the manual located under documentation in your Machina program folder. To demonstrate how to process channels independently in Pro Tools, we're loading a multi-channel reverb plugin called Dverb onto AUX1, which contains our strike sound. Now you can hear how this single sound is being affected by the reverb plugin. Feel free to add more effects to your auxiliary tracks or try out different mixes by adjusting the volume, panorama, as well as send effect settings in Pro Tools. Uh -huh.